Does memory loss mean dementia is starting? Memory loss can be a symptom of dementia, but it does not necessarily mean that dementia is starting. Occasional forgetfulness or mild memory lapses are common and often associated with normal aging or other factors like stress, fatigue, or distractions. However, persistent or worsening memory loss that interferes with daily functioning and affects multiple aspects of memory, such as forgetting important events, repeating questions, or difficulty learning new information, could be indicative of a more serious issue, including dementia. It's important to note that dementia is characterized by more than just memory loss. Other cognitive functions, such as thinking, reasoning, language, and problem-solving abilities, are also affected. Therefore, a comprehensive evaluation by a healthcare professional is necessary. To determine the cause of memory loss and any associated cognitive impairments. What is primary dementia and secondary dementia? Primary dementia and secondary dementia are terms used to describe different categories or classifications of dementia based on their underlying causes. Primary dementia Primary dementia refers to cases where the dementia itself is the primary or main disorder, independent of any other underlying medical condition. In primary dementia, the cognitive decline and symptoms are not a result of another specific disease or condition. Examples of primary dementias include Alzheimer's disease, frontotemporal dementia, Lewy body dementia, and vascular dementia. Secondary dementia Secondary dementia refers to cases where the cognitive decline and symptoms are caused by an underlying medical condition or factors outside of the brain. In these cases, the dementia is considered a secondary manifestation of another primary condition. The underlying causes could be treatable or reversible, and addressing them may potentially improve or stabilize the dementia symptoms. Some common causes of secondary dementia include A. Medication side effects Certain medications, such as anticholinergic drugs, can cause cognitive impairments and memory problems. B. Metabolic and endocrine disorders Conditions like hypothyroidism, vitamin deficiencies, such as vitamin B12 deficiency, and electrolyte imbalances can lead to cognitive decline. C. Infections Certain infections, such as HIV, syphilis, and chronic meningitis, can affect the brain and result in dementia. D. Brain tumors Tumors in the brain can cause cognitive impairments, depending on their location and size. E. Traumatic brain injury Severe head injuries can lead to long-term cognitive deficits and a form of dementia called post-traumatic dementia. F. Chronic substance abuse Long-term alcohol or drug abuse can cause cognitive impairment and contribute to a condition known as substance-induced dementia. By identifying and addressing the underlying cause, there may be potential for managing or even reversing the cognitive decline associated with secondary dementia. It's important to note that the distinction between primary and secondary dementia can sometimes be challenging, as some cases may involve a combination of primary and secondary factors.